Yo, what's going on guys? Today I've got an M1 Irons class setup with some gameplay afterwards. Uh, this is a new DLC gun that came out probably about six hours ago, so it's uh, pretty new, just came out. I've uh, been playing with it, been grinding with it, and uh, this is the class I've come up with as my best class. Um, you could call it maybe a class to get high streaks. I've already got a Relentless medal uh, with this gun. I haven't actually got a DNA yet, but I'm going to try and get a DNA because I think that would be pretty cool. But anyway, this is the setup. So we've got the M1 irons, the advanced rifling, and the laser sight. Um, the damage on this is pretty crazy. Like It's it's generally a two-shot kill, so you can see it's 12 damage. Accuracy is 8. It's not that accurate, but if you're good like with single-fire guns, it's pretty good. Like... I think most people should be able to, you know, get a kill per clip. Um, just so you guys know, there's only six bullets in a clip with this gun, and there isn't an extended mags attachment, so it's one of those things where you're going to have to be speed reloading a lot, so you're double tapping your X button, or for PS, you're double tapping your square, so you're going to want to be speed reloading because it's a pretty slow reload otherwise, and it's only a six bullet mag, so yeah. Um, fire rate, yeah, it's, it's a uh, revolver so it's not that fast the range now that's the thing it's it's not that great at range so i've got the advanced rifling on it which gives it a plus two range um the handling and the mobility it's it's a pistol so it's going to be pretty mobile but yeah that's that um so advanced rifling that gives you that two extra range which really you have to have and the laser sight just gives you better hip fire accu accuracy um it's pretty cool you'll see in the gameplay when you hip fire it's like uh you sort of your player like bangs the bangs the what do you call it the back of the gun to make it shoot so that's pretty cool but um it's definitely not that accurate so you could either go laser sight or quick draw as your second attachment but personally i like laser sight um for perk 1, I've got lightweight and low profile, so perk 1 greed. Uh, perk 2, I've got peripherals because it makes your minimap bigger with a UAV, it's, it's, pretty, it's pretty mad. Uh, toughness and scavenger. The reason I've got scavenger is because I'm trying to get these longer kill streaks, and as I said, when you're speed reloading, it takes away your the rest of that clip you had. So if you shoot 2 bullets and there's 4 bullets left, you speed reload you're going to lose those four bullets from your ammo count, so you're going to need scavenger to keep resupplying. Uh, streaks, I've got the UAV with speed, extra assist points and threat detection. System hack with disable XO, extended time, extended time, and assault drone with AR control, AR HUD, and rockets. Alright guys, I'll s Yo, so as you guys can see, there's six bullets in a mag of the m1 irons so as i said there's no extended mags as an attachment which is annoying but you just have to get used to it make sure you speed reload it's always the key like you've a lot of people are using this gun at the moment so everyone's sort of in the same boat so if you can be smart and reload at the right time you're gonna get a lot more kills and not die as much so as you can see here it's it's a pretty mad gun like it's sort of uh it's sort of like I don't know what you I don't know if you call it overpowered or not, but it's it's a really strong gun. Um, it's generally a two bullet kill. Sometimes long range, it's a three bullet. But with advanced rifling, you're gonna get a lot of two bullet kills, which is good. If you guys have enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe if you're new, leave a comment, let me know what you think. Follow me on Twitter. I'll leave it in the description. Thanks for watching, guys. Peace.